My name is Ray Thaw. I'm the owner of RTM Industrial Maintenance and RTM Industrial Crane and Rigging. We're on site here in North Garden, Virginia at Campbell Rogers Lumber Company. My name is Patty Rogers and I own and operate Campbell Rogers Lumber in North Garden, Virginia. Family run business, we turn logs into lumber. We cut some white pine occasionally, but mainly hardwoods. RTM is a full service installation and maintenance company that we specialize heavily in the forest products industry. Our team members, management, have over 100 years of combined experience. We know what the equipment's supposed to do, we've run it, we've made a living with it, and we try to, we try to bring that to our customers. We are here this week to install a brand new Clearman carriage and optimizer, as well as put down new track, do a final precision alignment, and get this build back up and running in a record time. I left college after my first year, I was studying engineering and I got burnt out with just the day-to-day -day school activities. Went home, went to the sawmill, went to work and got it in my blood, I never left. What led me into starting RTM was my love for the engineering, the equipment, the mechanics, putting in machines, making them run, bringing them, up, bringing them to life. Spending some time in the industry and actually learning what the equipment does, how it should perform, how to make lumber, and learning all the aspects of what a meal needs to operate day to day really has broadened my knowledge of what I'm able to offer to our customers. I was recommended RTM by several people in the sawmill industry. Um, when I first met Ray, I was very impressed with his knowledge, not only with the installation side of things, but also being a part of the sawmill world. He's been in our shoes before. He knows what it looks like to be productive and what it looks like to get there. Being sawmillers, we understand the expectations of the customer. And when we come in, we understand that we're shutting down the operations. That's slowing the cash flow, plus the expense of the machinery that we're installing. So we know how important it is that things are done in a timely manner, regardless of the situation, the weather, delays, when we tell someone our schedule that we're going to get something done, we stick to that, whether it's rain or shine. They all work together as a team, and that's, that's key. So that's been really nice, but also being part of the sawmill world. Knowing what it's like to own the business, a sawmill business, and what you need to do to get these machines to where they can be productive. I do every job with the intent of it is just like it would be for me. I don't. I don't like to cut corners. We're going to do it right. We're going to do it one time, and we're going to leave someone with a profitable piece of equipment to run. And we've uh, been on some pretty big, high profile jobs. Worked in one of the largest mills in the United States down to one of the smallest mills that uh, cut a pack of lumber a day. We pride ourselves on that we are set up and geared to, we want to help everyone, regardless if it's a small mill or a mega mill. And we, we're here to help. We want to extend our knowledge to benefit people, to make them more profitable, to ensure that they maintain jobs for their employees, and continue to take care of their families like we take care of ours. We don't like to come back and fix things. We want to come back because we're welcome back.